Hello guys and welcome back to another blind reaction. Today I'll be reacting to My Little Pony Season 7 Episode 16, 17. Because I think 16 was the campfire episode, which was a bad episode. So hopefully 17 will be better. Well, you can tell by the title what episode it will be. I have no idea. I mean, I don't follow anything, so I don't know. I don't even know the name. Uh, but, alright, let's see. What I probably will do is that I'll release two videos. One video where I'll try to cut out as much of the commercials as possible. And just it, pure reaction of the episode. That episode, that episode will be this, this that video. Probably will be a bit weird because I often tend to talk during their commercials. But since I'm gonna cut that part out. So, because I know some people don't want to sit th sit through me with the commercials. Even though I do cut out the majority of the commercials. Anyway. And I also put up right here, like, skip to for reaction. So we'll see. And here's the episode. Oh, way. Oh, they. Straight to the changeling hive. I told you I could do it. Oh god, Starlight exactly straight, Trinks Starlight. episode? We've been popping all around Equestria and we still have to walk. It's like 20 <laughs> steps away. Before Chrysalis' throne was destroyed, the closest magic would have gotten us was way over there. Yeah. <laughs> Up there. I mean, it's a couple ten, steps. How happy do you think Thorax is going to be about our surprise visit? Definitely ten. I mean, who wouldn't be happy at the chance to marvel at the overwhelming talent Oh God! Is, the great and powerful is this gonna be the episode that's... Uh, Trixie, fuck. We're coming to offer Thorax, Thorax would... encouragement and support. His letters make it seem like the responsibilities of being the changeling Yes, are and the changelings really are rebelling. Yeah. I know. Oh God, that's it's gonna be an amazing episode. Why are Starlight episodes the always the best? Redesigning the hive, a dread Malworth wreaking havoc outside. It does sound like a lot, but are you sure that last thing is real? The Dread Malworth? Sure it is. Thorax said it's like half bear, half mole, half raging pile of claws. But now that the changelings don't feed on the love of everything around them, plants have started to grow back. Okay, so that's why. Malworth. Uh-huh. You're just trying to scare me, but it won't work. Because not only am I the great and powerful, I am also the that stupid Trixie. Oh, if you say so, Trixie. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, is that the rebel? Also mentioned a terrifying fucking mohawk. Visitors, but it's actually nice. Nope. And I'm not nice. <sighs> fucking kill him. Starlight, you can kill him. You got us here. I'll take us home. Teleportation spell, go! Oh, good job, Trixie. Good job. Alright. Alright, so they've refurbished. What are you waiting for? You submit oh, to get us out of here! Calm down, unscarable Trixie. We <laughs> yeah. Find out what's going on. To Thorax change a help. changeling. We need our help. Teleportation spell, Wasn't go. that the same... Spell, or was that called a changeling can change? Spell, why do you keep doing that? You know it doesn't work that way. Because I'm a fucking idiot. I captured these trespassers. Starlight. Trixie. It's okay, Pharynx. You can let them go. But they were lurking on our grounds. In the old days, I would have already feasted on their love. Well, that's why they're called the old days. Because oh. they're old. We All right. don't do that anymore. So it's not re Rebels Rebels. He's probably... Yeah, I like the old days better. What are you two doing here? What was his name? To surprise you. <laughs> terrorist? <laughs> Fucking terrorist! Oh, it's great to see you. I'm sorry about the welcome committee. Uh. <laughs> I thought Ember helped you get more assertive so you could deal with all the renegade changelings who well. didn't want to change. Oh, she did. It's not that really easy. Helpful. I was able to convince all of them to change, except one of them, my brother. Oh, Your only brother? one? Yep. Ah, fuck Ferenx off. Is my elder broodmaid. So that's his brother, brother. Oh, yeah. You guys have the same mm, eye shape? What a 
ridiculous comparison. We are nothing alike. <sighs> Stop doing that. Don't I tell me what the fuck to do, bitch. Oh, well, how about I show you the rest of the hive where it's less loud and bang? <laughs> I love Trix's expressions like a fu just fucking been kill him. A lot of changes since you were here last. I'm trying to start some new activities since the only thing we did before was hunt and patrol. There's theater. Oh, nice. Swing dancing. Less nice. A once a week potluck lunch. Ooh, and who can change shape and organize crap time? Hmm? This guy. I am really impressed, Thorax. I guess. I all the activities. It's oh, nice to see. Oh, it God. Faring stumped an entire can of black paint on me. He said my fuchsia color wasn't intimidating to our enemies. What enemies? <laughs> I am so sorry. I promise I'll talk to him. You're the ruler of the hive, Thorax. You need to do more than talk. Well, right. maybe not everything here is amazing. Hey, she's correct. Seriously, you Thorax, need to do more than talk. I can beat the living shit out of your brother. Ugh. Pharynx used to be head of patrol, but now we're peaceful and there's no need to patrol, so he just stalks around the hive making everyone miserable. The other changelings are sick of it, and if I can't get them to accept love and friendship and change like the rest of us, everything I've done here is at risk. Well, I mean... Uh -uh. Hmm? Uh -huh. Well, hell. We know a thing or two about what it's like to be outsiders. Maybe we could talk to him for you. Do you really think you could help? Thorax, if there's any pony who can help your brother, it's me. And with uh, I, I, I thought she was that it's Starlight. I'm but worthless. I, we can do it. I fucking Trixie. I can do shit by Thorax, myself. We're ready to start work on the trail of plants to lead them all worth away. No, oh, I have to head outside. You're sure you're okay handling Pharynx? Absolutely. Oh God. Yeah. Is he autistic? Totally got this. <laughs> oh God. We're back, Discovery family. All right. Let's see the autistic brother. So, how do you want to play this? I'm thinking good pony, bad pony. You yell and blast him with magic. Well, my natural charisma will convince him that... Uh, he will convince start? him that all ponies hey, need to be exterminated. Thanks. I know when we what will we do with the pony problem? So well. I put you in the back. I thought it went great. Right. So, not a big fan of the vines, huh? No. You're a safety hazard. An enemy could hide in them or use them as weapons. I don't even know why they're here. Because they're pretty? That's ridiculous. I agree with him. Totally. We get you. But maybe don't express how you feel by destroying them? I don't take advice from ponies. The only thing I take from you is breakfast. At least I used to. You know, you're a lot like us. Doubt it. Yeah, bitch. It's true. Do you know who Twilight Sparkle is? No. Well, she's the most <laughs> well-liked, studious, do-goodiest pony in Equestria. Ugh, she sounds awful. Oh, you'd hate her. I used to. She made me unsure about my place in the world, which yeah. led me to act out Don't juice it. You still and do, I Trixie. Don't lie. A village with an iron hoof. Really? Hmm. Maybe you two do understand me. Yes, we do. But now, Trixie has come to terms with being second best. Yes. <laughs> I no longer control ponies against their will. And our lives are so yeah, much better. Second best, Trixie. Wow, so you're both losers. Stay away from me, or I'll do to you what I did to the vines. Well, Operation Lead Maul Wharf Away is coming along. I want to see Trixie being parents. like, what do you mean second best? Your brother is, um, yeah. challenging. She's way bad, bad, below bad. second. It wasn't come great. on. You want to talk it out? You can come with me to the feelings forum. The feeling what now? Oh, God. Oh, it's a place for changelings to express their feelings so we all gain a better understanding of each other. It's really helped bring the hive closer together. I mean, I can't understand him, like... Sometimes I feel like I'm a blue changeling. Sometimes I feel like I'm a purple changeling. But here I am. A green one. You can be anything you want to be. Be blue one day and purple the next. Yeah, you be can change. On the same day. 
But then I feel like I'd be living a lie. It's very brave of you to share something so personal. Oh, Jesus, Does the changelings have become have like concern? fucking hippies. I used to, but craft time has given me such a creative outlet. I feel great now. Uh -huh. Everyone loves craft time. I oh, know. definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Well, everyone except for you know who. Yeah, you know who spends all his craft time making spears. Makes He's sense. Scary. Maybe that's what Very he likes. Intimidating. You know who makes me uncomfortable. He makes us all uncomfortable. Everyone, please. I understand Ferrex can be challenging at times. That's an Ferex. understatement. He lined the hallway with thorns. He teaches little changelings to growl and hiss. So? Too hot. What? I thought the feelings forum was for sharing our problems. It sounds like your lame feelings forum is for talking about me behind my back. The feelings forum is for talking about anything that's bothering you. Is there something you'd like to share, Faring? I hate all Actually, of you. There is. Say that. Changelings used to be a fearsome swarm. Now we sit around talking about our feelings so much you can't even stop a malware from eating all your pretty plants. I could have sent that thing packing before, but I guess now we'll just try to lead it away and hope that keeps us safe. I agree I with, him. with him. Around. I feel safer if he were gone. I can't do that. We are oh, okay. oh, oh, Well, this is why you don't hey, democracy. These feeling forms are great for solving problems. If this was democracy, Everybody they would have banned him. Please, if we are interrupting each other, we are not affirming each other. No. Disgusting. Feelings forum is over. Oh, she doesn't have a horn. I noticed. I. I want to say something. But it goes against everything I've been taught as Twilight's pupil. Ooh, then by all means. We have it. to brainwash him. I think Pharynx is a lost cause. Mm, I'm all for second chances. Third even. But he just seems like yeah, a exactly. bad bug. And Thorax who, who gives a fuck? To the whole hive, not just his brother. If he keeps sticking up for oh, Pharynx, God. the hive might decide they don't want Thorax as their leader. I think we he have might to have kill to keep him. Pharynx out. I don't want to be the one to tell Thorax that. We, they need to take him out. But some pony probably should. Trixie? I nominate you. Ah, Trixie asshole. And there he is. He knows. Thorax, we have something to tell you. It's about Pharynx, isn't it? Is that Pharynx? Maybe. Look, I know he's an aggressive warrior type, but when I was little, every young changeling wanted to be like that. Or maybe not. Alright, yeah! ah, this is pretty cute. Every young changeling except me. The well, you were kind of a homosexual, weren't you? Look at the little grub playing with his dolly. <laughs> <laughs> Step away from my brother. But Pharynx never let them Oh, he was... So that he was we always like that coloring. Disgusting. Alright, I hate him now. I thought maybe he had changed a little bit and that's why he got these colors. But nope. Thanks, Pharynx. He had those colors all the time. Why are you hitting yourself? Stop hitting yourself! Why are you hitting yourself? <laughs> Ouch! Cut it out, Pharynx. They're right, you know. You need to have tougher skin. Uh, you need to fuck yourself uh, looking like That was a shit. really sweet story. Until the end. I know Pharynx loved me. In his own way. And I know there's still good in him. That's why I keep sticking up for him. Anyway, what did you want to talk uh, to me about? Just let him me? go back to Crystalis. No, but uh, Starlight has something she... Actually, Thorax, um, never mind. Come on, Trixie, we've got a thing to do. Yeah, we need to try at what least. What are you doing? I thought we agreed you'd tell Thorax he had to kick his brother out of the hive. Maybe we don't have to. Get Pharynx and meet me at the hive entrance. I'll explain everything. And he's gonna think. And how am I supposed to know where Pharynx is? I just saw Pharynx. Oh, well that was easy. Well, where did you just see him? 
Are they gonna try to lure the mole thingy to the hive? Just use one problem to solve another. I switched the trail of plants around to lure the mole wharf here. The changelings may not be able to stop it anymore, but the certainly can. When it attacks, he'll save his brother, showing every pony his good side. The others will accept him, and Ferris That's will a bad idea. Even Trixie knows it. Wow. I know, right? Great idea. Where's Fairings? He's gone. Gone like gone to the throne room? Gone like gone. One of the changelings said Pharynx left the hive for good. <laughs> and who's gonna stop the Dread Mole Wharf I'm leading here? You two. <laughs> and they're like, what, what the fuck? Why are you leading it? Thorax, there you are. Pharynx is missing. What? Wait for it. And the Dread Mole Wharf is coming this way. <laughs> there we go. That doesn't make any sense. The trail of plants should have led the Dread Mall Wharf away. Well, I fucked I up. I might have relayed them to lead it back toward the hive. Why would you do that? I thought if Pharynx saw you were in danger, the loving, caring side of him would come out when he protected you. But instead he's out there alone, somewhere between us and that rampaging monster? I have to save him. I'm coming with you. Of course you are. This is all your fault. Oh, uh, good job, Thorax. Monster. Good job. Her heart was in the right place. Uh, you're coming you're too. Coming too. Oh, right. I mean, I was gonna volunteer anyway. Sure, you were. Who else is coming? No one. Uh, fine. Oh, sure. You can all stay here, not help Bering, and he won't bother you anymore. It's your choice. But remember when you Oh, there are some changing without horns. You were forced to obey Chrysalis. You might have been unstoppable, but you weren't free to choose. And now you are because of Thorax. Well, it's his brother out there. So and what? Are you gonna to prove your justice make it so they feel the like as you were We are no longer ch now We now have to save to a person we fucking hate. Be. Hope no one does it anyways. That was an amazingly epic yeah, it didn't speech, work. Starlight. <laughs> I just can't believe not a single change thing was made. Oh, that's yet. great. I, I love that. Them. If he wasn't my brother, I don't think I'd be here. We're gonna have to face the Mall Wharf by ourselves. Maybe it'll be long gone and we'll find fairings out here alone. <laughs> Alright, let's see how does it look. Well, oh, he's fighting it. No, the stream is being fine until now. Oh shit! Yeah, it became that bug thing again. Ferex, what are you doing here? I'm here to save you. Fuck off, bitch. Get out of here. Let me handle this. We're not. I hate his voice. I fucking hate that voice. But okay, maybe I'll get used to it. Oh, Trixie using her. Oh, the stream paused. God damn it. Uh, I may, may have forgot to mention in my letters that mall wharfs have really thick hides. Yeah, well. Starlight fucking. I thought you said you could beat this thing. Yeah, with the rest of the swarm. Not alone. Good thing you're not alone. Oh no. No! I told you it was an epic speech. Oh, that one up there had a, a point. Like, uh, guys, can you see? Has the same as Thorax. With the little diamond things right here. And the same color scheme. It's no use. We're out of practice and he's too tough. And strong. Too bad we can't get it to fight itself. Well, maybe we can. When we were young and I made you hit yourself. Now is not the time to make fun yeah, of me. Just make it hit itself. Oh, right. Of course. Uh, why are you hitting yourself? Why are you hitting why yourself? Are you hitting yourself? Why are you hitting yourself? Why are you hitting yourself? Oh, fuck me. Yeah, Malworth, why are you hitting yourself? Well, this is probably yourself, the huh? worst huh? Starlight episode. And Starlight episodes are often like fucking amazing. That looks like it hurts. Like, I'm getting the fuck out of here. It's gone. 
Well, are you sure he isn't gonna run straight to the hive now? Leaving. I'm done with all of you. Oh, it's just why bother fighting the Mawarf then? You could have left it alone. Well, I couldn't just let it attack you. But I thought you were done with us, and you didn't care. Fuck off, never said that. Thorax. The hive is the thing I care about most. Well, you certainly don't act like it. Well, I'm sorry if I don't get excited about pretty flowers and feeling circles and... It's a feelings forum. Whatever. Fuck it you, matter. Thorax. Even if I do care about the hive, I obviously don't have a place there anymore. Actually, you do. No. Because we've been wrong. Um, the hive may be a gentler, nicer place. But that doesn't mean we won't have to defend ourselves. Clearly. Just leave. And who better to Go help us find that another than pack. Changeling who never stopped protecting us. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh no. You all want me to stay? I feel sorry for Unless Ferris now. They the obviously hive. don't give a I flying fuck about I him. And he obviously likes the hive. No. Well, fuck. Oh god. Well, he is the brother, but he transformed. I always knew you had it in you. Uh, really? Because I thought you said I was a lost cause, and you were going to tell Thorax he should kick me out. Uh, Starlight, how could you say that? Uh, what? That's. I mean, but you. Lucky for us, you weren't a lost cause. <laughs> like, Trixie is so. Starlight, you need to throw tricks under the bus sometimes as well. Glad everything worked out. Yeah, let's talk about how you not only led the Mawarf to the hive, but also drove my brother away from it. I am so sorry about that, but I would like to point out that my admittedly terrible plan what? to bring everything together in the end. Uh. Hey, do you guys want to hear the story about how I used to make Thorax hit himself? Yes. Oh, absolutely, yes, right now. Yes, we do. When we were young, every changeling wanted to be a warrior. Except for Thorax. He was a little weak. And I had to protect him. Alright, that was that episode. Eh. Oh man, it was not that good. There are some things I fucking love about it. Some things I fucking despise. I mean... I, first of all, I don't think that's such a bad thing that the fact that Starlight didn't fucking obliterate the mole worm is fine, actually. First of all, I think some creatures probably are immune or have resistance to uh, magic. I hope that's the case. Because, or else the opponents would just be able to fucking exterminate everything. So I think other creatures have things to combat that type of magic. It has to be the case. And I hope so, because you have to understand that this this show is under a pony perspective, and obviously it's going to be a lot of pony propaganda. And I understand that bronies will th eat the propaganda and the Kool-Aid, and that's what makes them bronies. Their lack of, well, bronies tend to be people who are free of the curse that is intelligence. I wish I was free of that as well. You don't understand how lucky you bronies are that you don't have to f suffer intelligence. So, <laughs> more about this episode. I, man, I wish he would have just left. I, I wish there would have been, alright, blah blah blah, we want you back now. And then he would have said, you know what? I love the hive, but I don't like you guys and there has to be another place out there for me for the things that i feel and like then if he would have gone and then maybe found chrysalis later on it would have been good and maybe it could be like i don't know but i don't like that resolution of i mean first of all him changing okay i don't care actually all right he found whatever, he changed, good, all good. His design, who cares? I just wish he would have left the hive. And then it could have been like, what would Thorax think then? Oh man, 
my own brother left. Am I doing the right thing? Is this the right thing? Then maybe another episode could have been more about that. Even though Thorax really believes that this is the right, he doesn't want to fight. There are some of them who won't leave the Chrysalis lifestyle. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Because this wasn't really rebellion or rebel changelings. This this was just his own brother. So I think that's probably something else. I really hope that line about some rebel uh, rebel changelings wasn't this. Because yes, he did say that. Well, I talked and most of them, or all of them, except my brother. Yeah, I mean, this episode was probably... As a Starlight episode, it was a 2 out of 9. Because Starlight's episode was also super good. But as a My Little Pony episode, it was a 4 or 5. A 5 out of 9. A 2 out of 9 as a Starlight episode. A 5 out of 9 out of a just regular pony episode. <laughs>